Okay, if this is the first video you're watching about routing, you know, electrical, this is going to make you pull your fucking hair out. I mean, it does have some really neat functionality, but I'll tell you what, this thing has so many goddamn bugs in it, it's just practically unusable. Um, And see, I still don't know why the fuck this is lighting up in orange. What the fuck does that even mean? It wasn't doing that, but then I had to delete all these old components because they were dead. I mean, you couldn't route to them. And there wasn't even any stubs on them. You know, I already put connectors in. And this, this one I put over here was the only one that actually had a stub on it. None of the others, they were just dead. They were transparent in the uh, assembly mode, so... Apparently you got to do your routing before you you know if you ever stop out of the whole fucking thing you can ever Reactivate the components So I don't this thing is just buggy as shit and I suggest you avoid it uh, So I mean you really can't go like put components and stop out and go do something else and then come back and route them later You really can't because you know it won't recognize them or whatever. I mean, I don't know what the fucking thing's doing See like I just place these two components you know, again, when I was in routing mode, this one's invisible, okay, um, and this one is the only one I can actually select. Um, now before, you know, when I'd stopped out, I mean, these didn't even have this stub here on it. I mean, it didn't have anything on it anymore. So, and I had two connectors here, you know, that were like that. And this tutor doesn't imply that anything like that should happen, so... But again, I can select one point to route, but can I select this? No. There's nothing here to select. I honestly don't know how I got this to work yesterday. I'm going through that first tutor. It must have been the luck of the Irish. Um, let's see, there's, there's just nothing. To, to, this isn't an active component, even though I just placed it. I placed this one, then I placed this one. Or actually, Jesus. Well, yeah, yeah. I guess I place that one, and then I place this one. So, whatever. And I mean, this goddamn thing shouldn't be rocket science, but you know, these assholes make it rocket science. You know, I mean, because like I said it's not just me. I mean, I'm not the only one that complains about this fucking thing being buggy and not well thought out. So, uh, just look at the forums out there. Uh, I certainly don't think this program is worth no, you know, 30 grand or whatever. Um, you know, you'd think they'd have more bugs worked out of this thing before putting a fucking, you know, uh, free trial or demo or whatever the fuck, you know, uh, like this. I mean, who the hell would pay this kind of money, you know, for <laughs> software like this? I mean, it's like I said, it's got some neat features, but my God, you know, I can't believe they fucking put crap like this out of the market. You know, making robust software was certainly not, you know, high on their priority list, I'll tell you that fucking much. <clears throat> See, it's interesting, you know, that I can select these clips, but I can't select this connector here. I assume I can't select this either, this LED I put over here. It recognizes it as a C point, but you know, even though I just place this within this uh, assembly context, yeah, I can't fucking select it no matter what. So, anyway, I can get it that far, but that's as far as I can goddamn get it. I mean, this is just buggy as shit. You cannot use this program. I don't know how the fuck I got it to work yesterday. Like I said, that was lucky. The only thing I can think of that was different is I didn't have all these connectors in it yesterday. I just, you know, all these uh, clips. I mean, I just had this connector at first, these connectors in it. But it shows you that, yeah, well, once you put shit in there, you know, you're screwed. So, okay, I just added a new connector into it since I started this route, now that's visible, 
Let's see what happens with it. It's weird, you know, the first time I, when I added these components before, you know, um, you know, I had to pull them in here one at a time. Here, I'm able to multiple, pull, multiply pull them in. Okay, well now I can, you know, complete it that way. I don't know what the rule of thumb is on this. Um, I don't know what to tell you. 